This is Integrated Math 1 practice test for 10 Ready, the 2017-18 version. This is question 17. We have two graphs, or graphs of two functions, I should say. They want me to select all values for x for which f of x is equal to g of x. When f of x is equal to g of x, that would be the point where they intersect. So they share a point for uh, plugins uh, for substitution's sake. If I had y is equal to 3x plus 5, there's a value for x I could plug in. It would give me y. So when I substitute in, shouldn't say plug in, I guess. Uh, if I substituted 1, 3 times 1 plus 5 gives me 8. So that would be a point. If I had another graph that also was uh, when I substituted in 1, I ended up with 8, those two graphs would intersect. The, no the thing about having a quadratic is that you can intersect in more than one spot. So here's point 1, here's the other one right here. So I'm going to say that this point is at negative 1, negative 4, and the other would be 4 and 6. Here's my x, here's my x, 4, negative 1. And that's really all you have to do for that one. It looks like it might be somewhat more complicated, but it's just not more complicated. Anytime you're looking for solutions or where the functions equal each other, you're simply looking for the point in which they would both share input-output coordinates or the point where they intersect.